We are off with the Traffic Safety Council of Zimbabwe to Bulawayo, to be precise, at Tumpilo Hospital, where the Traffic Safety Council of Zimbabwe took time to remember road traffic accident victims at Mpilo Hospital, where they donated material for use, particularly for post-crash victims that include mattresses, blankets, and sheets, among others. When everything else has been done and said, there's always that case that happens where there are accidents. And the post-crash needs a response. Uh, we realize that as we are celebrating the World Remembrance Day um, here in Bulawayo, maybe it's an opportunity for us to respond to that fifth pillar, um, which deals with post-crash. And uh, guided by our board, they tasked us to look for an institution that we would consider supporting. And we came to Pilo. We have brought here 90 mattresses, uh, hospital bed size. We have also brought in the 90 blankets that go with them and uh, 90 pairs of sheets uh, that go with them. At least we, we know that we have started supporting uh, the, the hospital uh, in terms of the post crash. Uh, I feel humbled to stand before you now having oversight a gesture which actually goes beyond uh, our day-to-day -day lives, remembering those who are men and remembering those who have lost their loved ones. And I'm so happy that uh, when we decided to come here, it was highlighted by the MP. It was unanimous to say, let's go and support um, Pillow Hospital. Yeah, I was so happy, the MD, when he highlighted that we've got adequate mattresses, we've got adequate blankets and sheets which shows that uh, the gesture is going beyond what we can imagine as uh, Zimbabweans, and if it can be extended to our day-to-day -day, uh, life in the way we, we live in our communities so that we remember each other. But I'm actually happy that uh, we are here in Bulawayo, and uh, it's our tradition that we'll be going through different provinces, and I'm happy that since we are here, and Maslow and your team, you will take charge of the items that you have uh, donated. To some of us, if we receive such donations like a blanket, we feel so happy because you can imagine if a patient comes and you don't have the blanket, you don't have the sheet, how are you going to miss such a patient? And you always remember that if someone is not feeling well, even in this world weather, they still need the blanket. <laughs>